सहनावत सहनौ भुनक्त सह वीर वह तेजस्वीनावधीतमस्तु मद्विषावह ओ शातिशाशाति ओ पूर्णमद पूर्णमद पूर्णात्पूर्णमुदच्य पूर्ण से पूर्णमाय पूर्णमेवशिष्य ओ शातिशाशाति ओ आप्या मंगा वाणश्चक्षुश्रोत्रमथ बलमींद्रिया सर्वाणी सर्व ब्रह्म उपनिषद माहम ब्रह्म निराकुरिया ब्रह्म निराकोदराकमस्व निराकरण मे अस्त तदात्मते यौपनिषत्सु धर्मास्ते मयि सत ते मयि सत ओ शातिशातिशातिस्मृतिपुराण आल करुणाल नमा भगवत्द शोकशंक शंकर शंकराचार्य केशव बादरायण सूत्रभाष्य भगवतन पुनः ईश्वरो गुरुरात्मे मूर्ति भेद विभागिने व्योमद्यादेहाय दक्षिणामूर्त नम ओंतर मुद्गीतमुपीत ओंतुदाते तस्ोपव्याख्यान पेज टू फिफ्टी षोडशकल सौम्यपुरष पंचदश अहानी मा आशी काम अपिव आपो मय प्राण न पिबत विच्छेत सौम्य षोडशकल पुरुष हे सौम्य ओ गुड लुकिंग वन द पुरुष दिस पर्सन कंसिस ऑफ सिक्सटीन कला सिक्सटीन पार्ट्स that if you want to verify this by verify this by your own experience then panchadash ahani ma ashi we will not eat any food for 15 days kama mapa pya however during that time drink as much water as you want why apo ma prana bus prana is made up of water and so If that you don't drink enough water, na pibato vichet sade iti. If you don't drink water, then prana will leave you. <coughs> so, shoda shakala purusha. What are the sixteen kalas? Vashikar explains. Anasya bhuktasya yeh anistho dhatuhu samanasi shaktim adhat. The subtle part of the food that is consumed. So that imparted adhat, sthapitavan, 
that imparted the shakti or the power to the mind. <coughs> Sa anopachita manasa shakti. This power of the mind which is nourished by the food. Shodasada pravibhajya. That shakti or the power of the mind itself is divided into 16 parts. Purushasya kalatvena nirdhidikshita. As a person is his mind. As a mind, so the man. So if the mind consists of 16 parts, the man made of a mind also consists of 16 parts. <coughs> Thus when the Upanishad says the person with 16 kalas or avayavas or parts, it means that the power of the mind has the 16 parts. Taya manasi anno pachitaya shaktiya shurashada pravibhaktaya The shakti of the power in the mind which has been nourished by the food which is now divided into 16 parts. Sayukta the person possessed of this power of the mind so divided, imaginarily divided as 16 parts. <coughs> Why 16 parts? Shura Siddhina Avachedena Shura Siddha Kalpanam Drashtavyam Because the experiment lasted for 16 days. Therefore, it is imagined that this, that the mind has 16 parts and so the person is made of 16 parts. <coughs> Tadvan Karikana Sangha the Lakshana Jiva Vishishta Purushaha Shura Sakala Uchade. This Purusha the person Sayukta endowed with the sixteen fold power of the mind. Tadvan possessed of that. <coughs> Tadvan, so the Tika said, Nakevalam, so Sayukta. Nakevaram tat sanyoga matram. Not only the person associated with this power of the mind divided into 16 parts. Kindu drashtvatvadi saravyavaharanam tan mulatvad tat pradhanasya tadvan. Not only does this person or human being possess the 16 parts, but then he is primarily made up of that. Tadvan, Tat Pradhanasya. He primarily is possessed of this sixty energy of sixteen parts. Kari Karna Sanghata Lakshana. One again is characterized by Karya and Karana. So that is the Purusha. Karya and Karana. The Purusha, that is Kari Karna Sanghata, made up of the gross and the subtle bodies. Jiva Vishishta that Karikana Sangada which possesses the the consciousness or the reflected Chidavasa Jiva Vishishta Purusha Shura Shakala Puchade this person characterized by the body mind complex is called the Purusha of sixteen Kalas. So not only Karikana Sangada body mind complex but the consciousness, the soul, the jiva, that is along with that, that whole assembly is called the purusha. Yasyam satyam drashta shrota manta buddha karta vijnada sarakriya samartha purusha bhavati. Yasyam satyam, which power of the mind, when it is there, Purusha Sarva Kriya Samartha Bhavati. The person becomes the capable of performing all these various activities. What are they? Dashta is seer, Shrota, hearer, Manta, thinker, Buddha, intelligent, Karta, doer, Vijnata, knower, etc. That a person is able to perform these various functions shows that he has the power to perform those functions. 
and power, that power is imparted by the mind. <coughs> How do you say the Anvaya and Vyatarika? As long as that power is there, so long the person is able to perform these various functions. Hiyamanayam chayasyam. But which power, when decays, wanes? Samarthya hanihi. We also find the decay or the decrease or waning of the capacity also. Siddhanagiri in the fourth line, Annarasajanitam, Manasakti Prayuktam, Sangata Samarthyam. The Sangata has Samarthyam, has the power, the capacity. Manasakti Prayuktam, the capacity that this body mind sense complex has is imparted to it by the mind. How did the mind get it? Annarasa Janitam, which capacity or, or strength is born of food and the mind thus becomes powerful. It imparts power to this Kairikana Sanghada or the body mind sense complex which is then able to perform the various functions of seeing and hearing and thinking. Vakyam Pramanita is Vakya Shesham Pramana means this Vakya comes later. Vakshati Vakshati cha Atha Annasya Ayi Dashta Ityari So when he has a lava, when he gets food, when he eats food, then Dashta is able to perform his function of seer, etc. Sarvasya Karikanasya Samartyam Manakrita Meva the capacity of this body mind sense complex is all due to the mind. So here Abhinava Narayana Nandendra so says here in the line thirty four Nanu Chakshuradi Samarthameva Drashtutvadu Hetuhu the manas samarthyam that you are able to see is because of the power of the eyes if the eyes have no power you can't see ears have no power you can't hear so it is well known that the hearing takes place because of the power of the ears the seeing takes place because of the power of the eyes the manas samarthyam where is the mind there how do you say it is due to samarthya the capacity of the mind. Says Chakshuradi Samarthanapi Manah Kurtameva. Says, no, even the capacity or the ability that the eyes, ears, etc. have is all of due to only mind. So, Vashakara said, Sarvasya Kayakanasya Samartham Manah Kurtameva. The entire Kayakana Sanghata, the body mind sense complex, has the capacity all due to mind only. So, Kayakana says Samartham, the Tika says Kayam, Shariram, Karanam, Indriyani. The body, sense organ, self, the Samartham, the ability, capacity is all due to that of the mind. Tadeva Spashtayati Anandagiri said Ukte Arte Loka Anubham Anukulayati This is what people's experience is that all this Samarthya the capacity is due to the capacity of the mind Tadeva Spashtayati He clarifies the Vashyagara or the other Tika says Karya Adi Samarthya Mana Samityatra Anubhavam Pramanam Aha so this Tikakara calls this as Anubhava Pramanam. Earlier Tikakara called the earlier Vakya as the Pramanam, Anubhava Pramanam. Manase Nahiti. <coughs> so we read the 
sentence on page 250, line 10. Manase nahi balena Sampannaha Balino drishyante loke Dhyanaha rascha Kechide Annasya Sarvat Magatvat Manase ne balena sampanna balino drishyante loke In this word, who are the people who are powerful? The people who are possessed of the power of mind. They are seen to be powerful. Say the tika, Utsahinohi, Shariradi Balasi Alpatwebi, Manase ne balena balamanto drishyante ityartha hai. There are people who have a lot of energy, a lot of enthusiasm. Shri Radhi Balasya Alpatvepi. Sometimes we find that they are very lean people. Shri Radhi Balasya Alpatvepi. Even though the power of the body is limited. And still, Manasena Balena Balavanto Dushyante. We see them as powerful. Because of the power of the mind. So this is Anuha Pramanam according to this Tika Kara. <clears throat> then Tika says, Dhyani Namapi Manasena Balena Balabhattvam Drishyate. Even people who are given to meditation, Dhyani Namapi Manasena Balena. For them also, the strength imparted to them by the capacity of the mind balavattvam dushyate the capacity to perform the meditation also is due to the power of the mind or as Anandagiri says kincha kechita manasene valena dhyana ahara dhyana ahara dhyana ahara dhyana meva ahara yesham so meditation itself is food for them. So we find them possessed of this power of meditation. Dhrishtam dhyana ahara dhrishyante manasena yobalena by the power of the mind. Tachya dhyanam anna parampara parinishpannam So ultimately the dhyana or meditation also is result of the food. Anna parampara parinishvannasya. The food, the subtle aspect of the food nourishes the mind. The mind becomes powerful. In turn, with that mind, they are able to meditate. And just remain with meditation only. They don't need any the food. Anna seva dehadirupena. Parinatattvat because is Annam alone that has transformed itself as this body. <coughs> so dhyana, then Mahashyakara said Dhyana Haraha Keshit Annas Keshita. Some people are their food is only meditation. Explain this, the Tika says in line 38, Dhyana meva ahara haiti. Those for whom Dhyana meditation itself is ahara of the food. Iti anena shari radhi balasadini bhutam ahara antaram nasti hiti. Darshayati. So by the expression dhyana haraha, what does the Bhashyakara mean to say? Shari radhi balasadhani bhutam aharantram nasti iti. Only meditation gives them the power even in the body. You find that some people are able to they bury themselves in their, you know, under the, in the, you know, in the ground. 
or remain without food for a length of time? Shariradi Balasadhani Bhutam. So the body, the sense organs, the bala, the power that the body sense organs has, we do not see any other source of energy. So we have to say that the meditation itself is the ahara food which keeps this body mind sense complex going. Kechi didyasya manasena balena balinayati purvanu shangena anvayaha. Kechi manasena balena sampannaha dhyana harasya dushyante. Some people possess the power of mind, are able to sustain themselves only on dhyana or meditation. The Dika continues, Nano, Andhakritam, Manasam, Balamuktam, Tej Adi, Sadhyamcha, Vaga Adi, Balamuktam. Wait a minute, what has the Upanishad said so far? Andhakritami, Manasam, Balamuktam. The mental capacity is said to be because of the food. That's what the Upanishad has said. Andhamaya me somya manaha. O somya, the mind is modification of food. Tej ari sadhyam cha vaga divalam. And we are told that the strength in the prana is due to water and strength in the speech is due to fire. Ta katham vaga adi karanasya sarvasya bi mano balena balavatvam. So, earlier the thing was that the eyes are able to see because of the capacity in eyes. But here now says, the Upanishad said that the power in the mind is due to food, the power in the speech is due to fire, the power in the prana is due to water. Tat katham vaga karnasya sarvasya bi mano balena balavatvam. Then how do you say that all these even speech also and prana also, that they are also, they also possess the power because of the power of the mind. How do you say that? Subhashakar is Annasya Sarvatmakatva because Anna is present everywhere. The food is present in the Teja also, in Appa also. The element Prasavi is present in the element water, grossy fire, as well as element fire. Says the Tika, Trivrit Kutasya, Annasya, Tej Adi Bhutat Magatvat. So, because each element is made threefold, and so what we call Prasivi. Conserve half of Prasivi, one quarter of the other two. Other two also contain one quarter of Prasivi. Trivit Kutasya, Annasya, Tejadi, Bhutat Prakatvat. Therefore, it is present in Teja also, fire also, water also. Manu Baladwara, Vagadi Baladhaya Gatvam. So even though the element fire may be seen to give the strength to the speech, but in that element fire, remember that one quarter is element earth, and that quarter gives strength to the mind, and through that, then the speech also becomes strong. Iti mano baladhinam. Vaga Adivanavati Bhavaha. Therefore, the, the capacity or the power that speech has is also due to mind. Because the food is present in the fire also. And food nourishes the mind. And that's how the speech also is nourished.
नरेंद्र पुनी एम से मनोगत सर्वशक्ति रूपेण अवस्थित तत्वाद व्हाट इज अन्न से सर्वात्मकत्वाद अन्न इज अ सेल्फ ऑफ ऑल मींस व्हाट मनोगत सर्वशक्ति रूपेण अवस्थित तत्वाद बिकॉज फूड इज वेरी मच प्रेजेंट इन द माइंड एज अ वेरी शक्ति और द वेरी पावर सृष्टि का प्रकृतम उपसंहरन अक्षराणि व्याचे और एवं पात निकाम कृत्वा षोड़शकल शब्दार्थमा भाष्यकार है गिवन इंट्रोडक्शन नाउ गिव द मीन द वर्ड षोड़शकल अतः नेक्स्ट सेंटेंस इज अतः अन्न कृतम मानस वीर अतः अन्न मानस वीर दर्फर मानस वीर द कैपेसिटी ऑफ द माइंड इज यू टू अन्न इज यू टू फूड देन एक्सप्लेनिंग षोड़श कला षोड़श कला पर्सन अंडरस्टैंड दैट The shoulders of Kalas presented in the Prashna Upanishad are different. As pointed out yesterday, shoulders of Kalas presented in the uh, Pasana of Satya Kama again are different. There are sixteen Kalas of Brahman of the cosmos. In Prashna Upanishad, the sixteen Kalas are of the person. श्रद्धा एक्सेट्रा यू नो सो प्राणम से प्राण श्रद्धा दट्स ऑफ प्राण श्रद्धा द फाइव एलिमेंट्स द माइंड ऑल ऑफ दिस मेकअप दिस सिक्सटीन कलास अकॉर्डिंग टू प्रश्न उपनिषद हियर द सिक्सटीन कला द सिक्सटीन फोल्ड पावर ऑफ द माइंड विच इज वॉट दिस पर्सन पजेस इज दर इज कॉल पर्सन विथ सिक्सटीन कलास सृष्टि का पंचदश अहान इत्यादि उत्तरवाक्यम अवतार फादर सेड षोड़ कल पुरुष उम्य पुरुष देन फर्दर से पंचदश आहानी माँ आशी हे श्वेत केतु मे नॉट टेक एनी फूड फॉर फिफ्टीन डेज सो देट वाक्य इज इंट्रोड्यूस भाष्यकार से इज एक्सप्लेन भाष्यकार एक चेत प्रत्यक्षी कर्तुम इच्छसे पंचदश संख्या काने आहाने मा आशी अशन मा कार्षी एक चेत प्रत्यक्षी कर्तुम इच्छसे दैट द पर्सन इज पजेस्ट ऑफ सिक्सटीन कलास If you want to experience this directly, so you are a person, so you are also consisting of sixteen kalas. And if you want to verify it by personal experience, then do what I tell you to do. Either means what? Manasa annamayatvam. That the mind is made up of food. That you are made up of mind, and mind is made up of food. If that is what you want to verify by your personal experience, then do this experiment as I tell you. Anand Nagiri said the same thing. Eta chabdena andikrutam manasam viram param rishyade. Eta chet pratekshi kartum ichcha se that the power in the mind is due to the that in the food.
देन पंच दश संख्या का न संख्या का नहीं आहा नहीं माँ आशे ही देन हेश्वेद के तू मे नॉट ईट एनी फूड फॉर फिफ्टीन डेज अश्रम माँ कार्शे ही डोंट ईट एनीथिंग ठीक आशे अनशने प्राण विच्छेदम आशंक्या है बस श्वेत के तू मैं आज इस क्वेश्चन वेरी मिनट इफ आई डू नॉट डीड फॉर फिफ्टीन डेज वेन आई नॉट डाई सो इन रिप्लाई टू दैट फादर सेड कामम इच्छा तो है अपह पिबर यस्मात न पिबत है अपह ते प्राण विच्छेद विच्छेद आपत्स्यते यस्मात आपो मय है अविकार प्राण है इवोचाम काम मीन्स इच्छा तो है एज यू विश अपह पिब ड्रिंक वाटर अपह इज ई एक्यूजिटिव प्लूर ऑफ दिवर्ड अप सो ड्रिंक वाटर टू योर हार्ट कंटेंट एज मच एज यू वॉन्ट वाय न पिबतो विच्छेद्य दे न पिबत है तथा न पिबत दी न समास है अपिबत है दैट्स व्हाट इट मींस ये समास है नॉट न पिबत है टू वर्ड नॉट टू वर्ड्स न पे अकॉर्डिंग टू क्या करा न पिबत है इस वन वर्ड ते प्राण विच्छेद से योर प्राण विल डिपार्ट विच्छेदम आपत्स्यते विल गेट सेपरेटेड यस्माद वाय सो आपो में प्राण है यस्माद आपो में है अब विकार है प्राण है ये अवोचाम बिकॉज़ यू ऑलरेडी सेड दैट प्राण इज मेड अप ऑफ फूड आई मीन मेड ऑफ वाटर और इज मॉडिफिकेशन ऑफ वाटर If water is not there, prana cannot be sustained. Or it Anandigiri says, "Which chedche the which chedam apatche the yasmat tasmat apaha pibayi purvena sambandha." Since the prana will depart, therefore drink as much water as you want. अपाम पान परित्यागे प्राण विच्छेद कारण दैट द प्राण विल डिपार्ट इन एब्सेंस ऑफ वाटर फॉर दैट द रीजन वॉज गिवन यस्माद यस्माद आपोमय अविकार प्राण है बिकॉज प्राण इज द मॉडिफिकेशन ऑफ वाटर प्राण से अमयत्व भी कि अपाम परित्यागे तस् उच्छेद Suppose the prana is the modification of water. If you do not drink water, why should prana leave? Suppose you ask that question. <coughs> Or as the other tika says, karane sadhi, karya sabi, bhavam, vyatre ek mukhe na aha, karane sadhi. कार्य से भावम वेन द कॉज इज देर देन द इफेक्ट इज देर दैट सेड बाय व्यतिरे का बाई दिसग्रीमेंट इट इज सेड नहीं थी सो नेक्स्ट सेंटेंस इज नहीं कार्य स्वकारणोपस्तंभम अंतरेण अभिभ्रंशमान स्थातुम उत्सहते स्वकारण उपस्तंभम अंतरेण उपस्तम बीइंग सपोर्टेड बाय द कार्यम द इफेक्ट वेन नॉट सपोर्टेड बाय द कॉज मटेरियल कॉज अभिभ्रंशमान न स्थातुम उत्सहते 
it is not possible for the effect to remain intact without the presence of its material cause tantu dahe pata dahe so when the thread is burned the cloth will be burned <coughs> in absence of thread the cloth cannot sustain itself so in absence of the cause material cause effect cannot sustain it is a material cause that sustains or upholds the effect said the tika bhrashyamanam so avibhramshamanam means what bhrashyamanam vinashi karyam karanopastam bhavantarena api sthatum utsade idi nahi then the karyam of the effect which is perishable it cannot remain intact in absence of the material cause apitu karanopastam be sati eva sthatam utsate di vyatareka parivasanam drashtavyam meaning that so no point in saying something negative you want to say something positive but bhashyakara says it is a negative language which means that karana upastambe sati eva sthatu mutsade karyam effect can remain intact as long as the material cause is there yadva apah piva iti ukte vipakshe badakam uchyate you can say that drink water if you don't drink water then what will happen apomaya prapomaya prana na vibato vichchesyate if you do not drink water tatra na vibata idi na samasa apibata prana vichchesyate idi tasmin pakshe hetu param bhashyam yathashrutam eva drashtavyam in that case if it is bhadaka if you don't do this then this would happen then the hetu param bhashyam the yasmat apomaya avikara prana is to be seen as it is and it is prana samayatve bi kimi apam parichaye tatsya uchedah even if the prana is made up of water what is it suppose you don't consume water why should prana depart so nahi bhashya kara says now that we already saw so vishna sat utsahate jeti so this is what the father say to the son to verify that the mind is made up of the food and the person the power, the capacity that a person has is due to the capacity of the mind and as a mind so the person in the capacity of the mind comes from the power imparted to the mind by the food so it's a very interesting experiment that the purusha the person consists of the mind the power that the person has is all due to the power of the mind the mind has the power made up of 16 parts therefore the person also has power made up of 16 parts so if 15 parts go away then one part remains that is how the idea is here <coughs> there you know, is some way of communicating how annamayam is somya manah that the mind is made up of food <clears throat> next sentence is page 251 सह पंचदश अहानी न आश अथ हईनम उपसाद 
किं ब्रवेमि भोह इति रुचसौम्य यजुंशे सामानीते सहो वाच नवयमा प्रतिभान्ते भोह इति सह पंच दशहानि न आश as told by the father the son swetaketu also did not eat any food for 15 days taken for granted that the disciple is an obedient disciple this shows the shraddha the disciple has in the guru so what are you talking 15 days why should i fast there's a question what does the father says fast for 15 days okay you will verify because you have a problem difficulty in arriving at this conviction as to how the mind is modification of food if you want to verify that by personal experience then do this is okay i'll do that sa panchadash ahani na asha therefore he did not eat for 15 days athahainam upasasada then he approached his father and said kim bravimi bhoho what shall i recite now revere sir what shall i recite idi ruche hasomya o oh, good looking one may recite the mantras from rigveda yajum shi samani iti may recite mantras from yajurveda mantras from samaveda Rigveda he was blank Yajurveda he is blank Samaveda he is blank Sahovach navayma pratibhanti bhoho iti says revered sir they do not appear in my mind they do not flash in my mind that means that he knew all the vedas this boy Rigveda is not an easy thing to know all the vedas in this young age because mastering a veda itself takes some 12 years we say total of 12 years and he has mastered all the vedas but today none of these mantras or passages appear is flash in my mind they do not shine in my mind meaning i cannot recollect them what shall i explain that सह मनस अन्नमय प्रत्यक्षीकर्छन पंचदश अहानी न आश अशन न सृत्वा सुबेन्द फादर सेट that may you not eat any food for 15 days however drink as much water as you want evam shrutva hearing this from the father manasa annamayatvam pratyakshikartum ichchan shvetakeru ichchan desire of pratyakshikartum verifying by his own personal experience manasa annamayatvam that the mind is the modification of food which is what you want to verify by his personal experience panchadash ahani na asha ashanam na krutavan for 15 days he remained hungry without food then next one अथ षोडशे अहनी हेन पितर उपसाद उपगतवान्पगम्य उवाच किं ब्रवीमि भो इतिवा 
अथ धेराफ्टर शुरु शेहनी हा एन पितरम उपसाद है हैविंग फास्टेड फॉर 15 डेज ऑन द 16थ डे ही अप्रोच हिज फादर उपसाद उपगतवान सो एज इट इज द इन दैट जनरेशन वेरी टाइम्स this sense used to have reverence for the father also and here is father as well as guru so when we approach his father in a proper manner he approaches upasasada upagatavan upagamya cha uvacha having approached the father he said kim bravimi bhoho iti o revere sir what shall i recite Then Vaisha continues, Itara aha rucha somya jumshi samani adhishveti adhishveti recites, He somya itara aha then the father said, He somya rucha adhishva may you recite the mantras of the Rugveda Yajumshi Adishwa may recite the passages of the Yajur Veda. Samani Adishwa may recite the mantras from Sam Veda. Vashaka says further, Evamuktaha Pitra. Aha. Evam Pitra Ukta. When the father said this to the son, then the son says, Navaima Maam Rugadi Nipratibhante Mama Manasi Nadrushyante Ityarthaha He Bhoho Bhagavan Niti. So when the father asks his son to recite Rug Veda, Yajur Veda, Sam Veda, Evukthan, he says, Evam Pitra Ukta Aha, son says, Navai Mamam, Mamins Mam, Rugadi Nipratibhanti. This mantra, Rug Veda, Yajur Veda, they do not flash in my mind. Mo manasi na drushyante iti. I cannot recollect them in my mind. This mantra is ityartha he boho bhagavan iti. I don't know the reason for what's the matter. So you know it, revered sir. I don't know. I can't recollect these mantras. Bhashyagara says further, evam uktavantam Pita aha Shrunu tatra karanam Yena te Tani Rugadini Napratibhanti te Evuktabandam Pita aha The son who is saying like that To that son the father said Shrunu tatra karanam Yena te tani Rugadi na pratibhanti di. Oh my son, the reason why, let me tell you, the reason why this Rug Mantra, this Tatra, they do not flash in your mind, they do not appear in your mind, you are unable to recollect them, so listen to the reason from me. So next passage says, Tam ho vacha. Yatha Somya Mahataha Abhyahitasya Ekongaraha Kadyotamatra Parishishtaha Syad Tena Tatopi Nabhu Dehed Evam Somya 
तेषुषाण कलाकला अतिशिष्टा सैया वेदानुभवसी अशान अथ मे विज्ञासी तम हो आच यथा सौम्य जस्ट एज ओ गुड लुकिंग वन महत अभ्याय से एक अंगार वेन द फायर इज सेट ब्लेज अभ्याय एंड एन द फायर बिकम्स क्वाइट एक्सट्रीम विशेष देन सम एम्बर से मेन यू नो अंगार द एम्बर बट हियर हाउ बिग इज एम्बर खद्योत मात्र परिशिष्ट है Ember of the size of a firefly remains after the fire has burned. Parishistha syat tera tato bi na bohu dehed. That poor little spark. How much can it actually burn? Only one thumbnail of its own size. That's all. It cannot burn anything more than that. एवं सौम्य ते षोडशा कला कला अतिशिष्टा सैर द बिग फायर दट फायर बिकेम क्वाइट एंड वन लिटिल एम्बर रिमेन सिमिलरली यू कंसिस्ट ऑफ सिक्सटीन कला एंड बाय फास्टिंग ऑफ फिफ्टीन डेज फिफ्टीन कलाज आर गॉन एंड जस्ट वन और ऑल सिक्सटीन कलाज रिमेन्स लाइक दैट लिटिल एम्बर आफ्टर द फायर हैज has become quiet or extinguished tena tato bi na bahu dehe the little ember cannot burn anything more than its own size similarly either he vedan नुभवसी सो ओनली वन कला रिमेन्स विद दैट यू आर नॉट एबल टू सी योर एक्सपीरियंस और रिमेम्बर द वेदास अथ अशान हे श्वेत के तू गो बैक एंड ईट योर फूड अथ में विज्ञास सीधी देन यू अंडरस्टैंड वॉट आई एम टेलिंग यू एक्सप्लेन दिस मार्शा सेज मुक्तवत पिता आह फर्दर यथा लोके हे सौम्य महत महत्परिमाण से अभ्यात उपचित इंदन अग्ने एकोंगार है खद्योत परिमाण है शांत से परिशिष्ट है अवशिष्ट है सात यथा लोक हे सौम्य महत अभ्यात से महत्परिमाण से फायर ह्यूज फायर सेट अ ब्लेज Of that huge fire, upachitasya indhneyi. That fire that is supported by the 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 fuel, the firewood. Agni he ek angar hai khadyo do parimana shantasya agni he. When the agni of the fire set blaze by the firewood, when that becomes quiet, it is put off or it extinguishes. देन परिशिष्ट एक है अंगार है खद्योद परिमाण परिशिष्ट है अवशि अवशिष्ट है इमेजिन दैट ऑल फ्रॉम दैट बिग फायर ऑल द रिमेन्स इज वन एम्बर ऑफ वेरी स्मॉल साइज ऑफ ए फायर फ्लाई 
ಅಂಗಾರೇಣಾರೇಣಾರೇಣಾರೇಣಾರೇಣಾರೇಣಾರೇಣಾರೇಣಾರೇಣಾರೇಣಾರೇಣಾರೇಣಾರೇಣಾ
फिर भाष्य का सेज तत्परिणाम ईशद भी न बहुदेत दैट लिटिल एम्बर कैन नॉट बर्न एनीथिंग मोर देन इट्स ओन साइज सो शेष आने के लिए ईशद भी न दहेत कुतो बहुदेत इति योजना फिर दिस पूर्व लिटिल एम्बर कैन नॉट बर्न एनीथिंग मोर देन इट्स ओन साइज वेर द क्वेश्चन ऑफ इट्स बर्निंग एवरीथिंग तुम तो दशान अथा मना पृष्ठ विज्ञास यू ईट एंड देन यू सी यू नो वॉट एवर ऑल और यू यू टू डिसाइड वॉट एवर आई हेव टोल्ड यू टू डू ओके ओम पूर्णम पूर्णमीद पूर्णा पूर्णमुद्य पूर्णस्य पूर्णमाद यूर्णमेवशिष्य ओ शांति शंक शंकराचार्य केशव बादरायण सूत्रभाष्यकृत वंदे भगवत पुनः ईश्वरो गुरात्मे मूर्तिद विभागिने व्योमदेहाय दक्षिण मूर्त नम शाते शा शाति हरि ओ श्री गुरुभ्यो नम हरि ओ